A silent night is tragically rare in parts of the Middle East this holiday season. MTS Tayeb is in the town of Bethlehem. It's the nativity scene that has captured the world's attention. And Pastor Munther Isaac, a Palestinian Christian, is the man behind it. They're looking for Jesus in the same way we see on the television with when a house is bombed in Gaza, people flood to that house to find any sign of life. Baby Jesus, as if he were born in the ruins of nearby Gaza. I don't think my faith has been ever tested more than in the last two months. It feels that even God is silent. Silence at the Church of the Nativity, where by tradition, Jesus was born on this very spot. Normally, this holiest of holy sites would be packed full of tourists and Christian pilgrims. But after three months of death and destruction and shattered lives on both sides, there's no Christmas in Bethlehem. Steps away in Manger Square, there's no tree, no tourists. Few here can remember a Christmas so somber. A somberness shared by hostage families in Israel. And in Gaza, home to one of the world's oldest Christian communities. I believe God right now is under the rubble in Gaza. God is in the operation room. Uh, God is with those who are homeless, who are uh, in despair. He suffers with them. He weeps with them. Uh, this is where I think God is more profoundly experienced. 